हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम अगेन टू ई जेड इंजीनियरिंग लर्निंग्स टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट स्टेबिलिटी लेट्स सी वॉट इट इज ओके से आई एम गिविंग यू अ सिंपल एग्जाम्पल माई डियर फ्रेंड्स दिस इज अ मार्क वॉट डू यू थिंक फ्रेंड्स वेदर दिस इज स्टेबल इट इज नॉट मूविंग अफकोर्स ओके देर इज नो मूवमेंट इन दिस एज ऑफ नाउ बट इफ आई टच इट आई गिव स्लाइट ओरिजेंटल लोड दिस विल फॉल डाउन ओके सो अफकोर्स दिस इज नॉट स्टेबल सी फ्रेंड्स दिस वॉज स्टेबल वेन वी वर गिविंग वर्टिकल लोड बट नॉट when we gave horizontal load okay now for example let's apply this knowledge to the frame structure now this frame is prepared in such a way that here this connection is pinned and this support is also pinned if you want to know in detail about this pin connection fix connection pin support fix support you can visit my other videos on youtube channel okay now what do you think my dear friends whether this frame is stable or not let's see we are applying horizontal load okay a slight horizontal load this is not stable okay so how can we make this frame stable simple thing uh, we will just go with the common sense my dear friends we are not applying a very big theories very detailed theory don't worry simple see when this structure is falling down what happens this angle changes right this angle was 90 degree but now it is trying to become bigger angle and this angle is becoming smaller angle so somehow if we restrain this angular movement then this frame can be fixed so how can we do that let's see See friends, what I have done? See, now we have arranged this in such a way that you cannot change the angle between these two. Means between beam and column, you cannot change the angle. That means this connection is now fixed connection. I would strongly recommend again. before going to this video you need to see our video of pin connection in our youtube channel so by putting this fixed connection what we actually call moment connection by putting moment connection this frame is now stable for horizontal load also okay now suppose in some case we are not able to give moment connection okay so what can we do how can we make the structure stable let's see we will again see the failure of this frame okay when we are applying this load this is falling down okay now apart from changing this angles what is happening just have a look on this see friends when this is falling down the distance between these two points is getting decreased and distance between these two points is increasing or in this direction 
now vice versa now this distance is smaller and now this distance is bigger so for making it stable my dear friends what we want yes exactly we want to hold this distance we want to restrain this distance if you can't restrain the angles you can restrain the distance between two points and how can we do that so friends this is the way this is yes you are right this is bracing so friends did you come to know about this we many of our engineers we know how to design bracing how to model bracings in different model different software sorry but actually what bracing is doing actually my dear friends this bracing is holding these two points at same position so is to make this structure stable whether you provide one bracing or two bracing that is okay but to make structure stable there are this different different options either you provide moment connection or you provide bracing okay now of course there are different ways of providing bracing different locations options where to provide bracing where to give moment connection uh, of course friends all these things will not be available free of course for that you need to join our courses uh, details of same is provided in the description thank you very much my dear friends before going to software you need to learn concepts what do you mean by the concept say for example there is a structure okay now you want to model this structure instead say for example you have already undergone the training of stead or etaps or both or maybe even sep but in that training you have learned how to model column how to model beam even in rcc or steel or any material you have learned that you have also learned how to model bracing but have you learned in that software where to provide bracing have you of course not because it's not the part of software learning my dear friends so if you don't know where to provide this if you don't know where to provide this plan bracing if you don't know which type of connection i need to model in the software then is there any meaning of learning software and exactly this happens that 90% of engineers have learned this software but they have not learned this thing so this thing can be learned by actually working on the projects if you are working for many years say at least 4 5 years on the projects in structural design engineering then only you can learn this but fortunately we have one more option to learn these things and that option is easy engineers private limited here in easy engineers private limited we have a practical course of professional structure engineering this course is about 4 months course in this 4 months course we teach you steel structural analysis and design concepts softwares rcc structural analysis and design what are the types of documents which we need to prepare for the projects what are the types of drawings how to study them how to get input from architect what inputs will be available what inputs we need to take from mechanical engineers what inputs we need to take from electrical engineers and what output we need to give to the site person all these things along with connection design crane girder design monorail design rebar detailing and so many things 
all these things which you will otherwise be learning when you will be actually working for so many years in the projects that we will teach you here and if we are not able to teach you if you are not able to understand all these things then your trainings are free simple okay even if you don't want to undergo for the full four month course you have options for short courses we have courses for even 10 days we have courses for 20 days and more we have almost four to five courses where we cover all these things for more details on this you can log on to www.ezengineers.in or you can call us on 9825106264 thank you everybody thank you for listening us